Hi guys, uh, welcome back to Dinosaur Week number two. Uh, again, we're talking more about fossils. You do have this book in your packet so you can learn about it. Um, and we are going to make some salt dough fossils. Now I've made a couple examples here. Um, when you're done, it'll look like this. I took an extra step on these two and painted into the reliefs so you can see it. Uh, and I'll show you how we're going to make it. Two cups of flour. And then we're going to mix a cup of salt into that. And mix a little brown into our paint. Hopefully give us a nice brown color here. We're just gonna start mixing it into our mix it slowly in. The recipe does say you can use food coloring. Uh, we're using paint in this one. If you don't use any paint or food coloring, it'll end up like this color. So you wanna try and get as much of that flour and salt mixed in. So this is a little messy. And you're gonna take your dough and we're gonna knead it. Grab one of our pieces of wax paper here. This will be very sticky. You put a little flour on the table and put some on your hands to help keep it from sticking so bad. Start laying down. Just gonna use using this jar to we want to get it fairly thin. Because the thicker it is, the longer it's going to take to dry. Okay. Pull that back. We're just going to use a cup. If you have a cookie cutter that's round, you can use that. But the cup works just as good. And we're going to cut out the shape. These were the dinosaurs I used for the ones I made earlier. We're going to use some different dinosaurs. So with this one, we're going to have it like footsteps. And sometimes the scientists find places where dinosaurs had walked through and they find their footprints. Other times, another one out. If a dinosaur dies, he's laying down on the ground. Push this down into the thing and then you carefully pull them back out and you see it shows you where the dinosaur was laying and then you you're gonna uh, if you have an oven you can bake these at 200 degrees for two to three hours to get them hard otherwise you just let them sit out for 24 hours and then they'll become hard. These do look like cookies, but you do not want to eat them. 
It would make you sick if you eat them, so please don't. And it's not going to taste very good. There's no sugar in it. So again, you could do like I did in this one and paint down inside of it. Or if you didn't want to do that, you could actually paint around the edges of it. So this kind of looks like it's dirt and you can see you're not going to paint down inside the holes. Just paint around it and then make it stand out that way too. So you've got a couple different options of how you want to make this look. All right. Hope you enjoy it. Thanks guys.